Hey, what's up everybody? It's your boy Carpo here, back again with another Division 2 video. In today's video, we're going to be going over the new Division 2 private beta trailer. We have the start date, we have a roadmap, we got plenty of missions, as well as a whole bunch of information. We're going to get right into it. But as always, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you like the video, smash that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, and stay up to date for more Division 2 video. So, you know what? We're going to just hop right into this. All right, let's talk about it. We got a lot of great things that are coming to the Division 2 private beta. As you can see right here on the screen, we're going to get into this. We got a lot of good stuff. We got Main Mission, Grand Washington Hotel. And we also have a Jefferson Trade Center. So we have two missions that we're going to be able to tackle. Now in the open world, we have five additional side missions and also control points and more activities right there alone. That's that's outstanding. But no, there's more. We have Dark Zone and Conflict. We got Dark Zone East and Skirmish PVP mode. That's just ridiculous. And then last but not least, for the end game that starts on February 8th at 8 o'clock Pacific Daylight Time, we have the Invaded Mission and three of the specializations. So look, Ubisoft, good looking. Y'all have outdid yourself. And this is this is freaking awesome. You know what I'm saying? That is a lot of content for any beta open closed private regardless that's just sick all right and then they go into further detail so i'm gonna read to you this right here oh and you know i'll leave a link down below so you can go ahead and check that out yourself if you want to go ahead and read it all right here we go now we will be limited to one character during this testing phase and that character cannot be deleted at the character creation you'll be able to cycle through presets of your customized features to randomize your agent remember Remember, the character progression is kept at level 7 during this private beta. So there's two main missions that are available. Like I said previously, we got Grand Washington Hotel and the Dreyfuson Trade Center to offer a smaller piece of a much larger compelling narrative that they're telling from start to finish. Now we can access these missions from Odessa Sawyer and Kelso respectively. Now as we explore DC there are five optional side missions also available for everyone who prefers to branch out from the main storyline and get their explore on. Now we have the Empire's Autumn Hotel, we have the MLK Library, Hostages, National Archive, Mustang Court Rescue, and Bureau Headquarters. Now you will explore parts of seven name zone each possessing a specific level range to let you know the difficulty as you traverse the world that's pretty nice now we have the white house also serving as our base of operations in dc we have downtown east the federal triangle the smithsonian final epiphany 
the 1040 and the dark zone east. Now, we all know what the dark zone is going to be. Now, the dark zone east is the largest of the three dark zones, so player can utilize long sight lines in a overgrown governmental parks. Now, they say here, you will acquire the DZ East introduction mission from Inerza, probably not pronouncing that right, but Inerza, all right, the new Dark Zone NPC in the base of operation after completing the Jefferson Trade Center. So after you complete the Jefferson Trade Center, you can go ahead and hop into the Dark Zone if you choose to do so. Now they say completing this intro mission unlocks full access to the Dark Zone and all of its features. In addition, a variety of control points, living world activities, and conflict PvP are all right here in this private beta so look this is this is outstanding this is a lot of content period this is a lot of stuff i'm pretty sure all of agents can't wait to get our hands off all of those people that have played it i'm pretty sure they are stoked too me i have not so i am thrilled to be playing some more division two let's go so that's pretty much going to end it for this video we have the start dates we have all of the information right here, and it is going down in just a little over a week. That is outstanding. Once again, the private beta is from February 7th through the 10th next week, and it's about to go down. So, as always, if you are new to the channel, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. And for everybody that has been supporting the channel, leaving comments, you know, hitting me up, asking questions. I truly do appreciate it. It helps out the channel, I'm trying to help the channel grow you and me together. And, you know, once I hit from 5,000 subs, I will be doing another great big giveaway. So help grow with me. And as always, I will see y'all in the next video.